Good morning, everybody. This is Guillermo with Live Trading with Guillermo. Got another video with overnight trading with the Ripper One. Uh, last night, I think it was around midnight Eastern, I turned on the automation uh, running two contracts on the CL, which is crude oil, and two contracts on the NQ, which is the NASDAQ 100. Um, I'm going to go ahead and post my settings in the description. That way you have those, so it can be pretty transparent for you. But basically, uh, a friend of mine told me that the the CL, you know, crude oil, moves in eight or ten cent increments. That's what he shared with me. So uh, he suggested that I should go for like a between an eight tick and a ten tick profit target. So I went with ten on the CL, and then on the NQ, I've been sticking to my um, uh, twenty tick uh, profit target on that. So that's the approach I did last night. But like I said, I'll post my, I'll post my uh, settings in the description so you, just so you have those. Just in case you want to take them for a test drive, uh, make sure uh, before you uh, test them out, you, you run them on simulation just to make sure it's um, something you want to do for yourself. But it worked wonderful, wonderfully for me last night, as you'll see in the video. I did use the kill switch at $800 profit. Uh, so I think it ended up... Um, Stopping the software, I think it had uh, grossed eight thirty-five. So it, I used the account uh, PNL. So uh, I had it active on both bots. I, I'm not sure if I ran it correctly or not, but anyway, you'll see the text is kind of crunched. I think I need to shrink down the font, and because I have two charts up at the same time for recording, I think everything got kind of jumbled up uh, in the text. But you can make out what's happening basically made 405 bucks on one and then 430 on the other um on the other instrument so that was pretty pretty cool to see everything worked like it was supposed to um and i just want to say sorry i hadn't posted a video in a couple days uh, as you guys uh, may recall i was running a beta version of the prop card you know true jade had asked me to uh, kind of test drive for them and i did uh not, not that it's not that it's up and running <clears throat> I reached out to Two Trade and uh, worked the deal so I could get my my licensing for my instruments so I could have it on all my automation uh, with the Ripper One. So the CL and the NQ now have the prop guard feature, and and that's why I decided to run both of them side by side uh, last night. Otherwise, I would have been stuck with just uh, the NQ for for a little while. So I kind of waited because I really wanted to get back to trading side by side because that was the the whole point. Of getting uh, to instrument uh, automation so with that folks I'm gonna let the video play out um, it was a good night uh, took two trades on each instrument uh, trading I think took only maybe four hours last night and, and then it killed uh, and then it, the switch killed the the bot and it was done so it was definitely uh, uh, smoother sailing than I've seen in other evenings um, by the time I got up this morning uh, which was around 6 15 uh, the bot had already stopped way, way, way earlier, which was kind of cool because I didn't have to interfere in any sort of way. So that was nice. But with that, folks, I'm going to let the video uh, play out. It is about almost four hours of trading. It's been shrunk down to about three minutes, three and a half minutes for your viewing pleasure. So with that, um, have a great day and I'll see you on the next video. Take care now. Bye.